Foundation, Module 5, Physiology, Respiration. Dr. M. Ashraf Thand. Founder and CEO of Dr. Sheen Medical Lecture. Super Fast Simplified Physiology. Video Lecture. Notes. Guyton and Hall. 14 edition. Chapter number 38. Respiration Lecture. Number 7. Port 2. Learning Objectives. 1. Explain the conditions in which lung compliance is decreased. Lung compliance is a measure of the lung's ability to stretch and expand. It can be affected by two factors, elasticity of the lung tissue and surface tension of the alveoli. Some conditions that can decrease lung compliance are Pulmonary fibrosis. This is a chronic lung disease that causes scarring and thickening of the lung tissue, making it less elastic and more rigid. Pneumothorax. This is a condition where air leaks into the pleural space, the area between the lungs and the chest wall. This reduces the negative pressure that normally keeps the lungs inflated and causes them to collapse. Pulmonary edema. This is a condition where fluid accumulates in the alveoli, the tiny air sacs in the lungs. This increases the surface tension of the alveoli, making them harder to inflate. Atelectasis. This is a condition where some or all of the alveoli collapse, reducing the lung volume and surface area. This can be caused by obstruction, compression, or lack of surfactant. ARDS. This is a condition where the alveoli become inflamed and damaged, leading to fluid leakage and reduced gas exchange. This also increases the surface tension and decreases the elasticity of the lungs. These conditions can make breathing more difficult and reduce the oxygen delivery to the body.